A tour around the university indicated that most of the university walkways, which are known to be having a number of students, had few or no students to and from the university. Most of the lecture rooms that we moved to were absolutely empty. This is a lecture room at the College of Natural Sciences. The blackboard still bears writings from the exam period for the previous semester. A few of the lecture rooms had one or two students seated, but with no lecture going on. Most of the staff offices were locked with padlocks, while the corridors remained empty. Though, the timetables on the various notice boards indicated that lectures were imminent or supposed to be going on, the rooms where the learning was supposed to be happening remained empty. The photocopying areas showed no signs of business. The police was also seen within the vicinity of the university in case trouble broke out. However, the Vice Chancellor, Professor Banabas Nawangwe, used his Twitter handle to indicate that lectures were going on. Later, the Acting Vice Chancellor, Associate Professor Eria Hisali, who was sitting in for Nawangwe, indicated that the council was in talks with the Makere University Academic Staff Association Executive to end the strike. Uh, this morning, we had an engagement with the executives of the Academic Staff Association and uh, the aim of our engagement is to try and get an amicable way out to get the university to full operation. He noted that Muasa issues would be attended to by the committees responsible once they are set up. Uh, the process is that it will have to go through the relevant committees of the University Council. These committees are not yet in place. Dr. Edward Mav affirmed that the strike would continue even as the association holds talks with the university management. There are various reasons for lectures not taking place. First of all, you are aware that we lay down our tools, okay? And also you know that if, if there is information that we lay down our tools, then the response varies from one place to another. For me, my major concern is to resolve the issues at what? At hand. Because even if they are, they are, the students have missed some lectures, lectures, those lectures can be compensated. However, Matthias Mpuga, the Shadow Minister for Education in Parliament, condemned the manner in which the Vice Chancellor ensures discipline in the university. The last person we want to see acting like a, 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 an African despot is the Vice Chancellor of a university. Mm -hmm. So, could it be that the, the good old professor, the VC, has legitimate concerns about the manner in which his colleagues conduct business? But his response, too, has issues that he must explain to the public because this is a public institution. You cannot resolve disagreements on how to run a public university by acting like an African despot. He needs to listen more to his colleagues and therefore respond to their grievances appropriately. Despite the various engagements between the Makere University Management and the Mwasa Executive to normalize the university operations, most of the lecture rooms remained empty and some of the support staff offices remained closed. Olivia Komgisha, NTV.